What's going on Aquatic Family? My name is Ryan from the Aquascape Gods. Uh, in today's video, I'm going to be doing an update on our Black Lava Rock UG tank. So the basis of what's going on right now is it's a brand new tank. It's going through its cycle and it's kind of trying to figure out what to do with itself because I got these plants as a tissue culture. So tissue cultures, they are grown immersed, which means they're grown out of the water and I'm putting them into water. So I want them to adapt to the way that they need to grow underwater because it can survive underwater and that is a big thing that's going on right now so you you will see some sort of um you know rotting is what typically goes on so that's when the plant basically melts um, if it's not getting exactly what it needs in order to grow inside of the water so you will see me pull up a couple of strands and little clumps of the utricularia graminifolia but that's okay because hopefully the rest will be perfectly fine and grow and spread and then I'll be able to take little chunks of that and put it in its place. Uh, and if that doesn't work, then I will replant with another batch and try it again. But So let's get into this. This is just my overall maintenance, what I'm going to be doing. So I'm just going to be doing a water change and just typical maintenance and this is what I do. And I like to do this about two times a week and I know that seems like a lot, but it's really what helps a lot with the beginning process of making a plant a tank. So I do it twice a week, I do a water change, and I do just overall maintenance where I like to scrape the glass, just make sure there's no diatomes on it or no algae so that it's not ugly looking. This is a display piece because it's that glass tank that we have, uh, so I wanna keep it as nice as possible for guests coming over and me just like, hanging out in the apartment, I just wanna look at something nice. So I'm taking my time with this, I'm making sure my I'm up to date with my water changes and I'm making sure that it's gonna look crystal clear always, no matter what. So let's get into it. Please drop a comment. Let me know what you think of this video. Let me know what you think of the tank. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. We're trying to hit that thousand subscriber mark, so help us get there. If you're not following, just take a second, just click it right there. But let's get into the video. I'll see you at the end.
So there you have it. That's how I do my weekly, if not almost daily, um, maintenance on my tank. I like to just kind of keep an eye on it always. Uh, so whenever I'm walking by it, I'll take a peek and I'll see what's going on. If something looks off, you know, not every second of my life, but if something does look off, I'll put my hands in there. I'll get a little wet and try to figure out what's going on. Maybe trim some stems that's uh, growing out of nowhere. And I like to keep an eye on things at all times. I don't like to, you know, wait until it's just too late. And then all of a sudden it's just a whole project to take care of. So keep an eye on it. Make sure you're doing your maintenance. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, I'm Ryan with the Aquascape Gods. I'll see you then.